Hi, my name is Suzanne Paquette. My book is Modern Memory Quilts. I'd like to talk a little bit about selecting the clothing for your quilt and how to incorporate it into your chosen quilt design. Right here I have two pieces of uh, three-year-old clothing and before I start any memory quilt I like to go over all of the clothing I have, look at to see if it has any special features that I might want to highlight in the quilt, interesting things I can use in the design of the clothing to really enhance the design of the quilt. So for this first t-shirt, um, the clear obvious choice is the palette on the front with the little paintbrush design. There is a choice of, of course, fussy cutting around that and centering it within your fussy cut, or I like to do something I call unfussy cutting, which is suctioning off um, part of the graphic print and, and cutting it off in interesting ways, and it helps add an interesting element to your design. The other thing I noticed about this shirt is it's got some nice uh, stripes on the sleeve. So I would then take this t-shirt, cut it along the seam lines of the sleeve, open it up, and that gives me a nice large space to work with. Likewise, then I've got a plain yellow sleeve on the side, which also helps color coordinate everything. I've also got here a little dress with some embroidery detail on the front. There are little gathers, which because this cotton is so lightweight, I'm not too worried about it because I can stitch right through it. Um, but I'd look at how I'd want to highlight that embroidery. Uh, as well, this dress has a lining underneath, so I might actually even just use that as, as a plain cotton to coordinate with the quilt. And then, of course, labels inside are always kind of fun. This one says Genuine Kids, which I think is really sweet, so I'd probably try and incorporate that into the quilt design as well. Sometimes I even include the size, and this one it's 3T, because um, it's a nice way to remember what the child was wearing at that age and, and brings back a lot of good memories. Um, so we have here, this is the animal silhouette quilt from the book. Um, and you'll notice that in this design, there are some long stripes. Now, clearly, those long stripes aren't going to be able to cut in one piece from the uh, small clothing. So I would just basically piece a strip before and then cut it according to the instructions in the book. But the great thing about this design is that there's lots of these small little rectangles, and they're really great for small size clothing. You can even get down to newborn size and get uh, pieces out of this. With the animal silhouette pattern, uh, there are two different appliques. There's a rhinoceros and a bird. You can always customize it yourself as well if you'd like to have a cat or a dog or any, really, any shape you want to do as a silhouette. You could draw your own template and, and put it on uh, the quilt as a way to customize it. In addition with these quilts, we added uh, a little embroidery detail. In this case, this one says, Love is Family. I wanted to add an extra personal touch for this quilt. My name is Suzanne Paquette. My book is Modern Memory Quilts, and you can find me online at Atelier 6 Design and on Instagram at the underscore milliner. And thanks for watching.